Are you thinking about moving to Northwest Arkansas but aren't exactly sure what town you should live in? Should you pick Bella Vista or Bentonville or Rogers or should you be south in Springdale or Fayetteville area? I'm Eric Eby with the Curtis Realty Group and on this episode of Naturally NWA, we're gonna discuss all things Bentonville. Bentonville is located in the northern part of what we consider Northwest Arkansas. It's surrounded by Bella Vista and Rogers, and it's basically 20 minutes south of the Missouri state line and just about 30 minutes north of Fayetteville. Now that you got an idea of where Bentonville is located on the map, let's talk about the commute because I'm sure that's pretty important to you if you're considering moving here. Walmart's home office is headquartered in Bentonville, and because of that, any business that has a product or does business with Walmart is required to have a regional office within 30 minutes of Walmart's home office in case they call an emergency meeting. Because of that, Northwest Arkansas has more management jobs per capita than anywhere else in the world. Most of the people who work in Bentonville are also going to want to live close by to Bentonville. So some of the cities you could, you could look at if you can't find a property in Bentonville would be Centerton is just 10 minutes away, Bella Vista is about 10 or 15 minutes away, Rogers is another 10 minutes away, it borders Bentonville actually, and then Lowell would probably be the next closest town is about 15 minutes away from Bentonville. Any of those towns are going to give you easy access um, through Interstate 49 to get to Bentonville to work. So now that you know a little bit about the commute, something else that might be important to you if you have rugrats is the schools. Bentonville has some of the highest rated schools in, in Arkansas. You can actually uh, go, on, go online and research some of the ratings that they have. There are 16 schools in the Bentonville School District. Eight of them are elementary schools, seven of them are middle schools, and there are two high schools in Bentonville. They're all very, very great schools. If you're interested in learning more about the schools and the ratings of the schools here in Bentonville, uh, you can, there is a couple different websites that you can check out that will give you that information. If you can't find anything online, feel free to contact me and I will help direct you to the right resource. So now that you have an idea about the commute and the schools and the location, let's talk about the lifestyle. Bentonville is a great, great place to live, not only for families, but also a lot of young professionals are living in Bentonville. Uh, for family activities, there are a lot of great things that happen on the Bentonville Square throughout the year, a lot of different events. There's a farmer's market that goes on there, and they have different events on the square all throughout the year. There's also, for families, there is the Scott Family Amazium, which is a very cool museum for kids. Um, there's also the Crystal Bridges Museum, which is uh, started by Alice Walton uh, of the Walton family, and it's becoming one of the most amazing and, and highly rated museums in, in the country because of the backing that it has. It's a beautiful, uh, beautiful museum, and it has new installations that come in and out quite a bit. Uh, Bentonville has also con ca been called the Disneyland for mountain bikers. Uh, there are 28 miles of uh, pristine mountain biking trails for uh, riders of all different skill levels uh, located in Bentonville and there's a lot more trails outside of Bentonville as well. So if you're into mountain biking and outdoorsy activities, Bentonville is a great place for you. Um, Bentonville is also home to a lot of different local restaurants and bars. Um, so there's a lot of stuff to do during the day with the outdoorsy activities and then at night there are plenty of uh, uh, really nice restaurants and bars for you to visit as well. So now that you have an idea what the lifestyle is like in Bentonville, let's talk about what you, the cost of living here. The average cost of a three bedroom, two bathroom house in Bentonville is around $225,000 and you're going to get about 1,700 square feet for that amount of money. Obviously, there are a lot of factors that go into housing costs, so if you want to get um, some ideas of some properties that would fit in your price range, please give me a call or give me a contact and I'd be happy to send you some more information. I hope this video gave you guys some really cool insight into what it's like to live in Bentonville. If you have any other additional questions about the area, contact me and I'd be happy to get you any information you're looking for. Be sure to click on the subscribe button above so you can follow me to get more information about what's happening in Northwest Arkansas and I look forward to talking to you. I'm Eric Eby with the Curtis Realty Group at HomeQuest Realty and I can't wait to show you more of our area on Naturally NWA.